Why is there no sound? Oh shit. Accursed was the key to finding the young woman. Yeah, so basically we go have to find this little uh I don't know what he is, cursed man. Uh because apparently he was the last one to see Siri alive, so we go uh, we know where he is. We need to go get him. What was your ending? I think Siri just became a witcher. If I remember correctly. Yeah, you can link it in chat, yeah, yeah. If I remember right, I can't even really remember. You sure fucking show that icy horse up. Oh, I do think I know this movie. I'll keep it open on a tab so I remember to look at it. You met her in the pub after? Oh yeah, I think so. So long ago, I can barely remember. Okay, so... Yeah, we need to go see Keris. He's up on this other island. Oh, can we fast travel up here actually? Excellent. That's the good ending. Now I'm worried that if I make opposite decisions, I'm going to get the bad one. It's about a dog, yeah, I thought that just from looking at the picture. Okay. No, every time. Waste so many crossbow bolts doing that. The heck's the door in here? Hello? Around the front. God, it's a sad we'll one. Be done in a moment. And then a giant sea snake swam up and bit my arm off. The gods have spoken. A sacrifice is needed. To my mind, it's about you defeating a snake, Yah. No, they demand a sacrifice. I'm sure of it. It's time. We must wait for a clearer sign. At least till your next dreaming. I don't need no more signs. Looking for Ceres. Heard she stayed here. On Crate's daughter. I she was here. Where is she now? Hmm. What? Ceres. Where's Ceres? Dunno. Dunno. Enough of the questions. I'm looking for Ceres. Any idea where she might be? I hope she's gone to the village. It's been a time since she visited. She wished to speak to our folk, but... But? I worry she might have gone to Jarl Udalric's old family home, though I tried to dissuade her. Clan Brockvar have something to hide from the Oncrate? No, it's not that. The house is a strange place. Many believe it haunted. Great. I love haunted houses. But why would Ceres go there? Before she left, she had a long talk with the Jarl. Seems she wanted to help him. With what? Ah! 
forgive me. I must go to him. A promising start. <laughs> Remember when that storm caught us in Old Bay? Aye, like it were yesterday. Hopcon fell overboard and near drowned. Can I not oh, this chest? Apparently not. I'll get that old box. No. This is balls. Why is there nothing to fucking loot? Okay, where's the house that she's went to? Just over there. Vagabond. Oh, hey. It was an honour. There's so many people walking by my house right now and I'm unsure why. Well, this looks promising. Winning yet, Kappa. Oh, I actually shit myself. <laughs> God damn it, Will, it's so creepy at this part of the game. <laughs> Thank you so much for the bits. I love how there was a sleigh ride going on at the back of me. Oh, my poor wee heart. That reminds me, actually, guys, if anyone does not know, I'm doing a Halloween stream on Wednesday night. So that was. That's. Not tomorrow, but the next day at 7 p.m. GMT. Me and Orca are playing Man of Medan, um, and I'll be changing my alerts to like Halloween themed ones. And I think we're dressing up too. He is going to a lot more trouble than I am. I kind of suggested dressing up as like a, a little thing we could do. And now he's like going full orc. Saris passed out. And I'm like, Gotta damn it! Out of here. But it should be fun. Orca's a big baby with the horror game, so it'll be interesting. What? What happened? Where am I? Oh, my head! Pain's just awful! Got hit with something heavy. Geralt? Why are you here? Came to look for you. Croc's worried. Taking you home. I won't go until I help Ulrich. The sword! Where's the sword? I've, I've got to go back! You're not going anywhere. I carried you out of there a moment ago, half dead. I have to! You have to tell me what's going on. So what's this sword all about? It's Brockvar, the ancestral sword of Udlerich's clan. I needed to lift the curse that holds Udlerich. A curse? Long story. Years ago, Udlerich and his little brother butted heads over the sword. As custom has it, the clan's sword should go to the firstborn son, Udlerich. But his father gave Bokvar to his little brother, Aki. Huh. Serious insult in these lands. Serious enough for Udalric to break a sacred law here in Skelligan. He openly questioned his father's decision. Guessing the old Jarl couldn't let it pass. They chained Udalric to a pile, up to his waist in the sea. Spent three days like that. When his punishment ended, he and Aki sailed out to fish. Got a feeling this trip didn't end happily. Your feeling's right. There was an accident. A storm broke out and Aki fell overboard. Udalric had his hands full with the sails. Didn't hear his brother until it was too late. Didn't hear? 
or didn't want to hear. Some folk on the Isle had the same doubt, but none would mention it aloud. I was really scared with Resident Evil 2, which I thought was hilarious, because I'm like, how are you going to handle Man of Medan? I think it was him that even suggested it, and I was like, you ran away in the forest and left me to almost die? I was like, do you want to play an actual horror game? <laughs> so it should be interesting. Uh, are you hyped for the Witcher movie? Yes, I'm very, maybe not hyped, but interested to see how that's going to go. What did you plan to do with the sword? I thought Aki's ghost would want it back. The brother's ghost? Long as I remember, folk have said Udelric's the chosen one. The one the gods speak to. I believed it once, but now, considering certain things, I think he's just haunted. And it's his dead brother that's haunting him. So you believe Aki's getting his revenge, because Udelric let him die? I've talked to Yort. He swears Udelric didn't start hearing voices till after Aki's death. And I don't think Yort's mistaken. He knew both those boys from the cradle. I think we have to give Brokvar to Aki, and he'll leave Udelric alone. Not a bad idea, on condition it's a ghost we're dealing with. But something doesn't add up. What's that? Aki drowned at sea, said so yourself. But the ghost haunts this house. Aki and Udelric both lived here. Maybe that's why. Thanks for your help, Geralt. But I've got to get the sword. Out of the question. I'll get it. Really? Thanks. So I can go see Udelric? No chance. Your weak might pass out again along the way. Wait here, we'll go together. Okay. Let's find the sword. Oh yay, a sailor. Yay. I cannot remember this, uh, I can't remember this quest, I can't remember what it, what actually comes out to fight me. And it's creeping me out. Spectre status recognised. Oh, hey Kimo. What is this about? the sword I found it let's go after you then you and my da you were mates once right hope we still are but well I heard you fell out over something or someone talking about that story with Yennefer long time ago that in fact that was before Croc met the woman who'd be your mother that you and Yennefer had already met <sighs> Uh, things were never cut and dried with Yen. What is it about her? What is it that draws you? Dunno. She's a feisty yeah. heart. It's because I've never chosen comfort and ease. The calm and the quiet. How are you doing, Kimo? Where is Yennefer? Hmm. Don't know. Why do you ask? I just wonder why she let you come here alone. What do you mean, let me? Nothing. Not a thing. 
Just got the impression she doesn't like to let you out of her sight. Look, there they are. Horridly bright out here. Stings the eyes. The fresh air will do you good. Horridly the bright. Gods won't be pleased. It's like. <clears throat> Jarl. It's like Our black guests. skies. Remember. Couldn't help overhearing your conversation. No worries. It's no secret. All in the Isles know Jarl Udelric hears the voices of the gods. These voices you hear. The gods. Their voices. More likely this is somehow related to your dead brother. I told Geralt of Aki. We concluded that... That the gods are angry at you, yet he's the reason. That's why you have to apologize to Aki himself. I... I didn't want to. Aki fell in the water. I... The gods will be angry. Let me help you, and I promise to do everything I can to keep from angering the gods. Heed the Witcher Jarl. Make amends to Aki and you'll surely please the gods. Did you have a bit of a busy weekend there? What would you have me do? Remember where Aki fell in the water? Near the Isle's eastern end, by the mouth of the bay, current had swept us towards Ulula's needle. It's a dangerous spot. Treacherous eddies swallow a handful of sailors each year. We need to sail there. Aki's ghost won't rest until Brockvar's returned to his remains. No. No, no, no. The gods. They'll be angry. I feel it. Fear not, Jarl. The gods love you. And they loved Aki. Surely they want this. Well, maybe I can sail there. The sword should be returned. That's what matters. Makes no difference by whose hand. What do I look for? Did Aki have anything that'll help me recognize him? Something he was wearing that could survive it does nothing. this time underwater. <laughs> it's I, just a way of wasting them. Clan rain. That ought to be enough. I'm off. Stop shoving me around. What are you doing? Okay. Are we boating, I take it? Clumsy sot. Oh, <gasps> guys, I think that's my delivery of books. Hold on. It's my books. I'll show you guys what I got. So I get them from a place online called World of Books, which sells secondhand books. Unless I want something like specific, like a hardback or something. But they do them, they tell you what kind of condition they're in. So I just go for the ones that say very good and they tend to be literally like almost new. So the first one I got was. Pretty Girls by Karen Slaughter. It's a pretty hefty book. It's in good condition.
It's definitely been red, but like the spines like hardly even got a crack on it. And then this one. Oh, have you asked for them, Will? Hopefully you managed to get those. Okay. There's three in here. So the first one is The Troop by Nick Cutter. This is like truly horrifying apparently, this book. This one's in a bit worse condition, but still good. It's actually bigger than I thought. And... Little fires everywhere. Which is just a contemporary that I've heard about. I've read the other one. It was alright, but I've heard this one's better, so I'm hoping it actually is. And the one that I'm going to read first. My Best Friend's Exorcism. And it's based in the 80s, and it's a com comedy horror. And it looks amazing! How good is that cover? I don't think this one's not even got the spine cracked. It's just made to look old as well and worn. It's so cool. I don't think this has been read. So I'm going to read this one first. I'm like so excited for this book. And this is the one that's in the best condition. Be kind, please rewind. Remember <laughs> your videotapes that you used to rent? Your VHS tapes? Love it. A summer horror flick. So it's basically a group of friends, but I think it's like slightly comedic horror, which is just sounds amazing. Um, Pretty Girls is apparently like Karen Slaughter's very good at doing thrillers, um, but apparently this is her most graphic one of all. It's like horrendous, apparently. Excited, and this was blurbed by Stephen King. There it's there. Stephen, it's on the front. Stephen King scared the hell out of me and I couldn't put it down, not for the faint-hearted. It's a body horror book, so terrible things are like happening to the bodies, which are, you know... Basically, it's a scout troop on an island camping and a guy turns up who is, who is sick, but they find out he's got some sort of parasitic disease, I think, and it starts spreading throughout the troop. Sounds good. I just finished Women That Smell Like Ham, a hilarious parody about an old the mainstream room. That actually sounds amazing. But yeah. I'll let you know how it is, because I'm going to start it like today. I'm reading I'm reading this from today. Because <laughs> I finished Misery, my Stephen King book I was reading. And I'm on a serious like struggle to find something else that looks good. So Sorry for that little interlude of uh, the game, but I was so excited for those books. Those are kind of like my birthday present to myself. <laughs> but I got all four, including delivery, for £17. Man, you can you can can whack it. Plus, repurposing books is good. Oh. Books are always exciting, exactly. Indeed. Okay. Uh, oh yeah, we're going to get the boat. So we're going to sail out. Let's maybe... What time of day is it right now? 4am. Let's go till 8 to get a bit of daylight. Also, can I do any alchemy? No. Okay. I think I checked that at the end of the last stream, so... My volume turned down there. This is the only issue I have with the Astro A40s. I love these headphones, I've had them for about 10 years, but see the uh, volume uh, thing that hangs down here? The the slider for the volume like moves so easily if it touches your jumper or something like that and it's it can be quite annoying when you're playing games to like change, change all the time. I don't really know how to get around that to be honest, I don't know if I'm better like putting it over the back of me. It doesn't really sit over the back though, does it? Like to get it out of the way, and maybe it won't, I don't know. Oh, 
Okay. You can put that away. I still feel like it changes volume. Because it's still hitting your body. If anything else, I think it's worse than it's back now. Okay. Enough moaning about my headphones. I really would like the... I kind of want to... Uh, change to the Steel Series headphones. I just think they've got like really good write-ups. I would like a pair of Steel Series. Must be the place. Okay, let's get the crossbow ready. Whoa, hi! I think there's a chest over next to those um Can't help wondering what that accomplished, if anything. Uh hello. I'm, hello. Seattle, Rick. I'm stuck. Thank you. Over over here. Next to that island. Let's see if now we've done the actual quest. Oh, my boat's getting fucked. I'll just swim. the war. Okay. The crooked mast marks the spot, but not just any fool can find the treasure. Where's your loot? Really? So is this it?
What's that? Go upgrade your armor. My armor's fine. Oh, there we go. Nice. I managed to get go through half of Novigrad with the original Witcher armor on, so I'm actually, you know, I like to take my time with the armor upgrades. <laughs> Come on and swim. Stop walking. So slow. Hopefully this boat survives till we get back. borrow their boat and then return it and like take a suit sir to know where it's raining what is the pick up there trousers a lot of rubbish I need to sell all this stuff or break it down or something Let's go tell them we've done it. Shit. Run! <coughs> what is this? Udlerik. The voice has commanded him to poke out his eye. What? Why do you do it? Such was the will of the gods. A sacrifice. For Aki. What? What did the gods want, exactly? Do you remember? What did they tell you? They were angry. A voice said, you vile wretch. You didn't help Aki, and now you failed to sail out to beg his forgiveness. Poke out your eye, suffer, and regret the evil you've wrought. When did the gods speak to you? Right after I left? Shortly after. Sleep came over me, so I lay down. Twas then they revealed their will to me. You always asleep when they speak to you? Always. What do you see then? Do they try to summon you anywhere specific? My old home. They command me to light torches, then speak from the shadows. Something's fishy. The gods always demand you offer them your suffering. Only that pleases them, so they ask for more and more. The gods speak from the shadows, you said. Is that why you don't allow any lights in here? In my dreams. At times I see their form, when the torches burn bright. To see the gods is a great honor. Maybe with more light in your house, you'd see them when you're awake as well. Lesser men are unworthy. They cannot gaze upon their faces. I returned the sword. The fuck nothing's is it changed. Doing? It's not his brother's ghost that haunts him, tortures him. What's wrong with him? Can we talk somewhere in private? The guest room. Come. I think he's full of shit. I need to fix that. It's no longer plus one GMT. It's just GMT. Well? Know what it is? It's a Heim. A post-conjunction creature. Very rare and very dangerous. It latches on to men who commit vile deeds. Oh, he's not full of shit. It feeds on their pain for years, fueling their guilty conscience. In the end, Heims force their victims to mutilate themselves. Sounds unpleasant. Any way to defeat it? Hmm. Two methods that work. In theory. 
Witcher's bestiaries say you have to spend a night in the Heim's lair with the affected individual. The haunted house, you mean? It's hardly cozy, but I wager you've slept in worse conditions. It's not about sleeping. You've got to draw the Heim out. It has to emerge from the shadows, show itself. Can't hurt it otherwise. And it's sure to give as good as it gets. You've seen Udelric. It won't be an easy fight. What's this other way? They say a Heim can be tricked. You have to pretend to do something horrible. Then it'll move on to you as its new victim. When it realizes it's been tricked, it'll be forced to leave. Great. Let's try it. Don't know anyone who's pulled it off. Well, maybe no one's thought of a trick that was good enough. I failed at this the last time. Doubtful, but we should at least try to find a way to trick the Heim. Might not be as simple as it seems. Besides, neither method's perfect. What do you mean? The Heim's a demon, and demons are notoriously hard to fool. Plus, the trickster can't know it's a trick. What? The Heim attacks those who have a guilty conscience, truly believe they committed a foul deed. The Heim strengthens their regret and feeds on it. Meaning, if the new host doesn't feel true sorrow, the Heim will sense that. Yes. So, for this to work, if either of us has an idea, we can't tell the other one about it. Exactly. Hmm. And what about the other method? Udelric might not survive an entire night in the Heim's lair. You think the Heim... Would it try to kill Udelric? No, that would mean losing its host. But Udelric could just... expire. He's weak, and the house will summon painful memories. Whereas to the Heim, that'll be an opportunity. The more pain the Heim causes Udelric, the stronger it'll grow. And the more dangerous it will be to you. Both methods seem risky, but I still think we should try the trick. Don't know that I'm convinced. Just please don't tell me you have to consult Yennefer on such things as well. If we fail to think of anything, we can always try the Witcher's Way. Fine. Hmm. Trying the trick can't hurt. Good decision. Haunted house. The Heim's lair. Only place where anything like this could work. After you, then. Hmm. No reason to delay. Let's go. I wonder if I can trick it this time. I never managed to do that the last time. Carrion crows haven't made their nest in a chimney. Solid craftsmanship. Fitter must have been from the continent. Siri. No, it's impossible. Damn it. Looking to discourage me? Good means you're scared. Somebody could break their leg or their neck. Shattered. Boodlerick must have been scared of seeing the creature just behind him. Cradle. Must have belonged to Udelric or Aki. Get out! Oh, <laughs> door. Come up with anything? Yes, I have a plan. One that just might work. Can I get any details? You've got to wait for me here. I won't be long. Uh, anything else? Said yourself, you can't know the details. So no, nothing else. You simply gotta trust me. Okay. 
Hope you know what you're doing. So do I. Hmm. Welcome back. So, can we start? Did Doggo enjoy the walk? I'm ready. All right. I'll be back soon. In the meantime, get a fire going in the oven. A few hours later. Over there! She's running to the old house! <laughs> Grab her! Take him. You must put him in the oven. Trust me. Take care not to hurt the child. Give me the feed. In the oven. Throw him in the oven. Do it. There she is. Oh, there's a door at the other side to get out. The Witcher committed no crime. You'll find neither despair nor guilt here. Only shock and relief. You've been tricked. You must go. It's over. Over? We tricked the Heim. It thought I'd killed your child, abandoned you to haunt me, feed on my conscience. But when it saw the babe was whole, unharmed, it had to go. You're free, Jarl. Free? The Heim's gone. So are the voices that tortured you. Let's get out of here. Thanks would be nice. What's happening? My head's spinning. I'm spinning in a maelstrom. Geralt, you said it was over. That's just fatigue. In time, his mind will return to normal. What? What will I do now? I love your life. You'll be fine. Key is to not give in to self-pity. I feel as if someone's torn something from me. That's normal. The Heim was a parasite. Bonds between parasites and hosts can be strong. That's why you feel empty now. Give it a few days, weeks, you'll be fine. Thank you. I think. Farewell. It's actually a really nice day here today. It's about two degrees, but there's no wind at all, I'll which means it's like cracking weather. Confused. Good idea. Then what? What are your plans? I'll stay a few days, make sure he's healthy. And you? Gonna stay on speaker rock? Don't know yet. Gotta gather my thoughts. I'm sure Yennefer must be grown impatient. What is it with you and Yennefer? Mentioned her several times already. Nothing. I've just noticed that you're often of one mind. Saying I'm henpecked. Not that you're especially different. Seems to happen to all men. 
take a rowdy skelliger, a brave knight or a tough witcher, you all end up wrapped around some woman's finger. Though I will admit you're not all bad. You trusted me, a complete stranger nearly. Few would have had the courage. I appreciate it if you didn't tell everybody in the aisles. They'll think I enjoy being dominated. Oh, he does. <laughs> Farewell, guys. We know it. Oh, See my you, mug's Sarah's. empty. Okay. Ooh, oh, I've got two points. Did I not use them? Nice. Okay, so I think I finished up uh, my delusion, which I did. Yeah. Um, what's the next one? When? What's the alchemy? I'll maybe just get this to max and then that's me got these three and these three and then I can start doing some more. There we go. So my delusion, my quen and my... Um... Oh wait, that's three of five. Oh, this can go up to five. Nice. Uh, and my igni are leveled. Okay, so, uh, yeah, let's go do that. We also need to, oh, that's back in Novigrad, so that's fine. And then that's us, we're going back to Novigrad after this. So we'll go do this. Uh, so we'll go up to the waypoint. Can I do any more alchemy? Superior black blood. Nostrix rebus. Hmm. Ergot seeds. Hmm. I've got loads of superior oils that I don't have the actual enhanced version of. Oh, there's the enhanced. I don't even have normal vampire oil. I'm missing like the normal oils for these to get the enhanced version. It's weird. Because if I get this, I can immediately get this. So I need these. I'm mostly missing mutagens for these. White gold alchemy ingredient. So this requires mistletoe? Wow. And white gull. Is that a... Oh, it's an alcohol. Oh, I need cherry cordial and mandrake cordial for that. Interesting. Should get these pretty easily. I also need this nostrix quite a lot. Okay. It's fine. 
Right, let's go to the fast travel. Maybe you can buy them. Yeah, I, I am. Um, I've seen it. I've seen it around. I just don't have any on, like at this moment in time. But uh, once I'm back in Novigrad, I can start collecting stuff again. I've got a feeling the some of the baser potions are ones I've missed in Velen, and that's why I've picked up superior ones. Uh, like after that, and I've missed the beginning ones. Is what I'm thinking. But yeah, should be. We should find. The sun's coming out. <sighs> and it's making my hair green screen. That's always fun. That is always fun. Love it when my, the sun comes out in Scotland for the first time in like a year. It just makes my life so much easier when I'm streaming with a green screen. Whatever. That will go away again. Master Geralt. A guard spotted you from the tower. They sent me to open the gates. Why was it closed? Is that famous Skellige hospitality? Me? Tis tradition. After the feast, the Jarls will choose the king, so the doors must remain closed. Only the sons and daughters of Skellige may stay in the castle. Krach make an exception just for me? All yeah, I just did that, Nostromo. I was pinning them there. Today, you're Thanks. one of us. Come. Krach awaits. How's the mood in there? Calm. Too calm. How's that? We've an adage here at Skellige. At a good feast, meat and blood flow in equal measure. Uh, Surely you consider this barbaric on the continent, no? Not sure. Sounds preferable to dull banquets garnished with court intrigue. Step careful there. I've as much right to it as you do! And I'd expect you to support me, not pinch my allies. If an aunt crates to wear the crown, it... Should be you, because you've got fur growing on your chin, that it? Show some of your own, and the Jarls just might listen to you. Don't your mug smacked? Remember, I was left standing last time we crossed fists. <laughs> yeah? So you'll fight the Vilkarls with me? Wonder who'll do better? You? Or Yalmar, the Giant Slayer? Ah, oh, stop your shite ghosting! Cerus! Hey! Ah, damn it! Don't see Krach. He talking to the Jarls? No, went to his chambers. To prepare your promised reward, no doubt. If you've a spell witch, or perhaps you'd fancy some fisticuffs with the Vilkarls. Loosen up your joints after your journey. Maybe later. Did you sever Got me spell? eye on you. Something I've always wondered. Beautiful. What you witches do once there are no battles, legends, giants around? There are always giants and legends around. Greetings, Berna. Feast not to your liking. This is no feast. It's a farmer's market, where votes are bought and sold like sheepskins. Leaving Kertrolda? Tomorrow at daybreak. Enjoy yourself, Master Geralt. Oft. May I? You must even. Come! 
I've been waiting for you. So, feast to your liking. Any better than your continental balls? Definitely more to drink. Ah, <laughs> there is. Rolled all of it out of my cellars. Double meads, triple, Cintrian plum brandy, Mahakamum spirit that burns the mouth like boiling water. Clan on Crate knows the meaning of hospitality. Promised me a reward for helping your children. And I aim to keep my word. Here. This bauble's been in the family for generations. I give it to you for helping ensure the line endures. Beautiful craftsmanship. Thanks. I'm the one. <laughs> about this. Go up with the beers. <laughs> Do you know who did it again? Cloth, give me some cloth. Gotta stop the bleeding. <clears throat> Quick. Duh. Uh, take my cloak. Hold on, son. You'll pull through. A shark grabbed my leg once. Albion! He's dead. <laughs> Crack! Where'd those bears come from, huh? Answer! Now! Careful how you speak to my dad. Stow your blade, pup, or crack will lose a son too. You insult me, Lugos. And now you threaten my son. I will not stand for this. Dad, come here. Come on. Put you down like a rabid dog. Calm down. Calm down. Enough blood's been spilt. Someone brought these beasts here to murder our sons and brothers. We cannot restore their lives. But we can. We must avenge them. This burden falls upon the host and his offspring. Shit. Find the guilty on crate. Find and kill them. Else your clan will be cursed for a hundred generations to come. Guys, he's got a big hook in his neck. Damn it. Things have sure gotten messy. That's putting it mildly. We've clues to examine. Things to consider. We must find out how this came to be, elsewise we... We've no time for that. I know where to find the guilty. Wait? Are you mad? You're gonna kill folk before we've learned what happened. Learn all you want. Meantime, I'll go wash the shame off our clan. Hey, the Yards aren't listening anymore. 
Stop playing the hero and think for a second. Our honor's at stake, sis. I can't wait. Are you listening to me? Someone let those bears in. We must know who, and the answer lies somewhere in this room. <sighs> See, I helped Ceres the last time, and I still want to help her because the other guy is just not fucking thinking straight. <laughs> But I want to make different decisions since the last time. I'm going with Yalmar. Don't know where, but I'm going. Knew you'd not turn down an adventure. I'll stay here. Someone must see to everything. Summon the healer, hand the fallen over to their families. Wolf, I thank you. We ride to Fornhalla. At a gallop. I want to see what happens when I choose this guy. Right. We're here. Meaning? Could I explain what we're doing or not? Remember the wild men I sparred with? The ones we called Vilkarls? You might have mentioned them when I walked in. This is Fornhalla, their village. They were the ones who changed into bears, just like in the legends about berserkers. I saw it with my own eyes. Might have been alone in that. Everyone else was staring at young Lugos. He claimed he could down a barrel of beer in one go. Almost did it too. So what now? Simple. We welcomed the Vildkarls under our roof, gave them food, drink, and they spilled our blood. So now they must pay, in blood. Should at least take one alive, make him testify before. This ain't the continent, Witcher. Don't need no court to see justice done. Stop to consider that somebody might have duped them, used them? Then they'll die for being idiots. Enough jabbering already. Let's go. I wholeheartedly disagree with this guy, but whatever. No one here. Ran away. Knew I'd come for them. Odd. From what you said, don't sound like the type to lack courage. Let's look around. Could be nearby. Look! Up there. A corpse by my reckoning. Mm-hmm. Needs examining. A Skellige custom I don't know about. If it is. It's new to me as well. Clothing from six men. An old shrine covered in runes. I know the signs. Language of our forefathers. Svalblood. Damn it. What is it? Better name? Aye. A deity whose worship is banned. All altars devoted to him were raised years ago. Priests stolen and were bound, tossed into sailless longboats that were pushed out to sea. What did this deity do to earn condemnation? Him? Nothing. But those who promised him almost drowned Skellige in blood. You see, Svalblood demanded sacrifices. Human sacrifices. Sword of the Ready Witcher. Strange smell. Bit like incense. Bit like a bait we witchers use. For what? Bears. Crikey. You've a sniffer like a hound's. Better. Follow me. Better. Follow the thread. Wounds covering the body, but he didn't bleed to death. Someone broke his neck, finished him. What the hell's going on here? Don't matter. Body's still warm, they're close. Come on! Hmm. This is more interesting than I thought it would be. Human scalps. 
Unusual as decorations go. Why can't I examine them? Ochre, coal dust, woad, tattoo dyes. I'll bloody give them tattoos. Dried mushrooms. Psilocybe, I think. Geralt, finish up your ferritin already. Dried mushrooms. Oh, shit, I didn't mean you do that. Psilocybe, I think. Geralt, finish up your ferritin already. Spiked gloves, black with dried blood. Press an E here. Trap door under a bearskin rug. Classic. Come on, open it. Oh, it was me trying to get me to use the ladders. That's what it was before I opened the thing. Air is thick with incense. I'm gonna puke. It's as though. Shh. Hear that noise from below. Finally. Looking for death? Nay, vengeance! And answers. Why do you attack Kertrolda? We didn't come to the feast to kill, but we've no regrets about what happened. There are weaklings in every herd. They must die to make room for those are strong. This blood. guy's accent's a bit mental. Strong blood. Strong blood? What are you talking about? I speak of the she bear and her cub. We've talked enough. Good. Talking tires me. Hey, Croy. Out of him. He'd be Don't a big fluffy. Everything's clear. Blood yes. For blood. <sighs> Realize they might have acted at someone's behest. Might have just been part of a plot. We on Crate always have foes. Let them plot. Let them strike. They'll end like the Vilcarls. Voices. More of them further on. I'm counting on it. Let's go. This guy's out for blood. Let's just save. God knows how many other bears we need to fight.
Svalblood! Svalblood! We summon thy power! What? Me either? Am I going to wrong way? Forebears forbade all from worshipping Svalblood, on pain of death. What? Where'd you? From Care Trolder. Bet you know why we're here. Aye. On a matter that's not to you, mutant. A matter of pride and honor. True. Not my concern. Yalmar, he's all yours. I could just butcher you like a swine. But I'll let you die with honor. Defend yourself! to die. Gotta give him that. A letter. Turns out the Vildkarls. Unwitting tools. This druid, Artis, was to be the new king's advisor. Cheap reward for sicking the Vildkarls on your guests. Causing all that bloodshed. Who signed it? Nobody. Anonymous. You were right. There's someone else behind it all. All the mayhem. What now? I'll tell the Jarls what we found here. Hope it's enough to clear the clan's name. Come on, we're done here. Hmm. It was them attacked us. The Veiled Carls. Will you claim they turned into bears? That they're the berserkers our nanny scared us with as children? Is that it? I saw them transform with my own eyes. Did Is you that see her? Rhea ride by a straight of wild boar as well. The one that was leaving the wife? You've discovered as much as your sister. That's to say, nothing. I'll vouch for Yalmar. Why would we believe you, eh? You're a lackey to on crate. And a witcher. He knows beasts, including those that take on human form. Go on, Yalmar. What about? I found the traitors, wrought vengeance on them. That's everything. No, not everything. The Vildkarls conspired with someone. Found a letter on one of their corpses. Her? She looks suspicious. Yeah. 
This does not identify the guilty party. That's not why we've gathered. You washed away disgrace with the blood of our foes, Yalmar. I, eldest among the Jarls, cleanse your clan's name. We part in peace. So it is true. Warriors have become bears. I'd say it's the opposite. I saw their transformative ritual. Our trial of the grasses. Pure pleasure by comparison. The Vilkarls have been punished. You and Yalma saw to that. But our true foe continues to prowl about. It does I look cool. hard times ahead for Skellige. But enough. Whatever comes, we must endure. I thank you, Geralt. Again. No need. Again. I'll not take any more of this modesty. This is a land of heroes. Let this remind you of that. And it's now, snowing where you are, where's that? I was right for getting it. For the Jarl's council. So jealous. Time to pick a king. What do you think? We'll get the nod. Come with me. See for yourself. All may listen to our deliberations. I do have a horse in the race. Can't refuse, to be honest. As I thought. Well, let's go. Oh, nice. We won't get snow till, like, March. We never get snow uh, until, like, late, late winter now. We're just in time. They've already started. Weren't long ago... We gave King Bran back to the sea. Today, our mourning ends. Today, by the grace of the gods and the clans, a new ruler takes the crown. Let us swear him fealty. this day. We strike at Nilfgaard! Yarnar! 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 Point. I don't know if I want to put more into this. What's in the red again? Mm. Deflect arrows while parrying? Yeah. I don't know. I don't know what I want to take now. Uh, it depends what armour you're going to be wearing. I mean, I'm wearing the cat stuff just now. Could probably take this. When does this unlock? Level 28. Okay, now we travel back to Novigrad. Let's go.
Okay, where are we going? Oh yeah, I need to... Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Um, there we go. Back to Velen. How bare does this place look compared to the other one? Tell the Baron Sergeant you want to take over. Is that not down at the Crow's Perch? Why have I not got a marker? I'm confused where my marker's going. I'm pretty sure it's Crow's Perch. I'm heading to. His long search for Siri led Geralt to conclude that Uma, the ugliest man alive and the victim of a curse, was the key to finding the young woman. The ugliest man alive. How rude. Have they seen every man in the world? How do they know he's the ugliest? Let me grab my bottle of water. Okay. That's better. Oh, I'm thirsty. Uh, right, we can put this away. We still got no alchemy ingredients? No. That's fine. Let's go. At least my marker's back now. Like to take a look. What's this? Read for additional information. Okay, there's stuff that I need. Let's get rid of some of this stuff. Do, do, do. Level 29 for that crossbow. Check. 
What else did I need? Missile tool, that's right. call on and create ancestral did you just sell it to some random merchant yes i did it's not even that good uh also i think i've got a better crossbow than one i'm using five to seven plus one to eight percent attack damage this is better right What level man? 22? I can actually go get the master stuff soon. Level 24 that one. Oh hey damsel, how are you doing? It's been a while, I hope you're doing good. Hey Fergus, it's been a while, how are you doing man? Oh you got a day off, nice. How's your green hair getting on? Wouldn't mind a look at your stock. Video games and dinner, that sounds like the best day off. Right, I need to sell this stuff and all. Well, I've not put that one yet, I don't think. Is this a better, better blinders, actually? I can sell this one. I need to check that. Okay, have you got anything of use? No. Infused dust. So long. <sighs> You're fading out, doubting whether I'll read diet green or go back to your normal color. I'm sure he had other things in mind when he gave it to you. Well, he should have thought twice then. Fancy a gander at our little stockpile. Show me what you got. Yeah, I've been good, thank you. It was my birthday yesterday, so I did nothing except have a bit of a drink and just chill out, really. It was pretty good. See ya. Those are the best, yeah. I was out on Saturday, but just at my friend's house, uh, we do like an annual get together for Halloween. We watch Hocus Pocus, we carve pumpkins. It's like child friendly. Um, so yeah, we did that on Saturday. So Sunday, I was just sat on my couch and did not a whole lot. Mom and dad got me a new bo got a bo me a bottle of whiskey. So I tried that out, you know, had to see if it was any good. It was one I hadn't tried before, which was good. 
and it was really nice. It's super smooth, like I can drink it neat. It needs nothing in it. No water, no ice. It's pretty good. Air got seeds. Oh, must have used those for something. I'm sure I had two of those. Buckthorn. Oh, I get that from the water. Could get that easily enough. Could get rid of this one. Okay. What do you see here? So maybe nine next Tuesday. I'm hoping to do the same. <laughs> nice. Yeah, I ended up sitting watching Pulp Fiction, and I tried to play some World of Warcraft with Orca, but then, like, my brother and his wife showed up, and then they left. Oh no, like, my mum and dad showed up, and then they left, and then my brother showed up, and then by the time I got dinner and watched a movie, then my sister showed up, so I ended up not getting any gaming done. Need to talk to you. About? Uma, gonna take him with me. Gotta ask the Baron's permission. Thing is, he ain't here. Not about to ask for anything. I'm telling you, you can try to stop me. But that'd be an error, a mortal one. Think you well, got me you shaking in my boots? You sure as hell should be. And what are you going to play now that it's sorted? Fine. Cripple's not worth no blood. See the groom. He ought to be glad to give him up. Bugger's been eating from the feed bags. And a pleasant journey to you both. Thank you kindly. Can I look this place? No. Apparently not. CPU 30, oh my god, 32 gigs of RAM, nice. You're playing WoW. Oh, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Got to get them trick treats for pets. <laughs> Sounds good. Me and Orca did Wailing Caverns last week and got the worst set of randoms yeah. ever, and it was just. We were in there for three hours and never completed it. It was actually, I felt like I'd. I felt like. I wasted half my life in Wheeling Caverns. It was it's not overly fun. There he is. I've already looted this place before, haven't I? Wait, how did I get in here? Wait, what? Where am I going? Six feet under the birches. Why do you have to play the hero? My goodness, I know. That was yeah, rough. How far the fuck did I get this? It's clearly another door. No. Oh, here? I, 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 did I walk right past it? No, I did not. Uh. So, we have to milk some milkmaids. Nah, don't feel up to it. Oh wait, tell the person minding the stables that you're taking Uma. I'm an idiot. Is it this guy? I'm taking Uma. <laughs> there ain't a. Ah, hey, Ogos, how Hull you doing? Said I could. Bring him back though, won't you? Be awful dull without him. Yeah, we had a warlock that just kept taking the aggro away from the tank constantly. And then 
Orca was having to try and heal, but he's not really a healer. And he was having to heal the warlock so much. Is that a warlock? Shaman? No, warlock. I can't remember. It was something anyway. Someone was taking all the aggro constantly. They weren't given the tank long enough to take aggro. They kept hitting them. And then someone ended up having to leave and we were a man down. And yeah, it was just... It was... It was horrible. Find something else to laugh at. I don't know. Catch some frogs and shove straws up their asses. Okay. <laughs> That one of your Witcher games. Witcher version's different. Don't make me show you. Open the door. Now. Let's get Uma. Wait. Why did I fail a quest hey, there? Guy. This here's Roach. She'll take us to Kaer Morhen. Well, come on. Best character in game. I actually completely forgot about this character. It feels, it feels unloved, man. Uh oh. Looks like we got company. Hey, Skorak. How you doing? Welcome. What do you want? The Emperor's displeased with you. Then he ought to ask somebody else for help. The Emperor does not ask anyone for anything. You will ride with us to Vitsima. Sure about that? Don't even try. Fine. Lead the way. So you went all the way into work to find out you were actually off? I suppose it makes your day quite productive, I feel, if that happens, because you're up and dressed and out and ready to do stuff. You got any plans for your two random days then that you weren't planning on? And the third army will sweep in from the west to take Banglin. If I may, your Imperial Majesty. Our spies report that the garrison at Van Glien consists almost Sounds good. wholly of mercenaries. I hate that game. Then. We stand to lose exactly no men in battle. And we stand to lose less time. Very well. Give the orders. Then set sail. As you wish. Oh, hello. At once. Your Imperial Majesty, Yennefer. <laughs> I did not have you brought here for an exchange of courtesies. Report. As you wish, Your Majesty. Siri. Well, this man is the key to finding her. <laughs> I give you three solid leads. Trails as fresh as morning dew. The aid of my spies and my court sorcerers. Yet in my daughter's stead, you bring me this... monstrosity? <gasps> I hope you have more to say. For your sake. Listen, I'm looking for a needle in a haystack. A needle that at any moment can... It's a difficult task, I know this. What of it? Listen to me. 
I rule the largest empire the world has ever known. I wage a war against the North, command men in tens of thousands, while at home the trade corporations and nobles seek to depose me. You cannot expect me to pity you the difficulty of your task. I don't, you just don't need to be an asshole. This monstrosity might well be your daughter. Its body is the product of a curse someone hides inside it. Can you lift this curse? I've done a great deal of research, made inquiries, but to lift it I would need to know the words used to cast it, and that... Dandelion told me. Siri talked to him about it. At last, you provide a pleasant surprise. Lady Yennefer, my question stands. Yes. I, I believe I can. But I must... The details do not interest me. Geralt, you've achieved precious little, yet admittedly more than the bumblers in my spy corps have. I give you half the promised reward. You will receive the other when you bring me Siri. Fine. This audience is over. Till the next. Okay, I'm bringing Siri back here. Plus, does he really think he can keep her? Even if he wanted to? And just blink out? So, how do we lift Uma's curse? We must take him to Kaer Morhen. Oh, and Geralt, forgive me, but I'm unable to teleport you, Uma, and Roach, so... Don't worry, we'll ride there. Never did like teleporting. Oh, Take no! Yourself. Wait. Here, probably better talk. if you keep it. Of course. I'm off. His long search for Ciri led Geralt to conclude that Uma, the ugliest man alive and the victim of a curse, was the key to finding the young woman. Geralt needed to lift the curse, so he took Uma to the home of the world's greatest specialists on dark spells, to the Witcher's Fortress of Kaer Morhen. Kaer Morhen. And we return. Oh. oh there, Roach. I need to put my new blinkers on the horse, actually. I just remembered. Fork tails this close to the fortress? Someone's been slacking off. Quite a while. Too long. And your journey, how was it? Calm, if you don't count the forked tail that flew over our heads a few miles back. Passenger got a little restless. Hey, Sprite. Thank you. Multiple deformities, eyes, ears, nostrils, a hair lip, and is this... <laughs> now, now, calm down. Yennefer was right on one count. Thing sure isn't pretty. Yen's here already. And how? Huh. You two argue? Geralt, I understand she's a... Well, how do I put this? Emancipated, strong-willed woman. But do manners count for nothing? She Stop pecking your in, feet. Not even a nice to see you jumps right into a we've a curse to lift. There's this to do and that. So Eskel and Lambert get going. And she went to the guest room to 
rearrange things. Chilling at work for ten. Nice. Off the balcony. So where is everyone? Esco's hunting fork tails. Gotta nip that infestation in the bud. And since Yennefer needs to distill some ingredients from their organs, well, like they say, two birds, one stone. Lambert's still in the keep, preparing to venture into the Where's mountains to enrich the phylactery <laughs> with elemental power. Mm -hmm. And Yen? Assembling a megascope. Wanted my help running around with some chirping contraption, searching for something. But I'm too old for that nonsense. I should let her know I'm here. If you say so, but don't go thinking she'll throw her arms around your neck. Okay. Let me have a quick look at the quests. So, I've got the cat skill upgrade. Actually, is um. Not far off my level now. That I can do in Novigrad. Hmm. I also have... Um, not that. There's a. I've got this, which is level 20, 24. It's a bit high yet. And Hattori, he's at level 24. So, at level 24, I get Hattori back and I get the Master Armor, which is not bad. Okay. I'll keep doing the quest here just now then. I'll get to level 23 and I'll go do the cat school upgrades. And then once that should get me close to level 24 to do the other ones. So I'll keep doing this just now. To get to level 23. Dabbing emotes are a thing. Okay. Repair kits, nice. Okay. In the military dab, ironically, dudes in full uniform 44 overall a constantly pissed mood and he dabs. <laughs> that would be quite funny. Uh, leaking again, damn it. What's this? Brewing potions? No. Booze from Where did these emotes come from? Hmm. For my welcome back feast? 
Actually, more like my farewell feast. Haven't heard? Madame Sorceress has requested I fortify the phylactery with power from the Circle of Elements. Says it's essential to lifting the curse from that monstrosity of yours. Don't sound too thrilled about all this. I'm not. You know the trek to the Circle's no walk in the park. In more ways than one. Let me go with you. Well, might have more spring in my step with the famous white wolf at my side. So, you ready? Gotta take care of something. Wait for me. Sure. Wait. Why is it not taking me to her? Or him? Show me the waypoints, you fucker! Well, oh, screw it, I'll just do this guys first then. Just do this first. It's clearly because I've spoken to him. Everything's ready at my end. No reason to wait. Let's go. Oh, meant to tell you. Can't get to the circle through the mountains. Rockslide blocked the pass last spring. So we approach from the pond side, like when we did the trial of the medallion? Exactly. What Remember the hell? The Not easily forgotten that. He who returns with his medallion will prove himself worthy and may set off on the path. Vesemir ever hear you impersonate him? <laughs> yeah. Old man can't stand it. Sabola's breach. Still haven't patched it up? Vesemir'd like to. Doesn't bother me, though. Not expecting anyone to lay siege, and... This way I got a shortcut to the pond. Shame those Salamandra assassins didn't punch a few more holes in our walls. Or finish the job and reduce these ruins to rubble. That was full rage, she'll start throwing balls at trees. Been thinking, are you gonna swim across the pond? No, I got a boat moored there. You know, for fishing. Wow, never took you for the fishing type. I use bombs. I drop them in, then scoop up whatever floats to the surface. Hmm, <laughs> that makes sense. No, what the f why is it in that? Rude. Hunting's almost a diversion if I get it. You gotta get me one. From this old master down in Zeracania. Yada yada. Save that tail for your next sorceress. 
loot. Nice. No problem, Sprite. Thanks very much for stopping in. Have a good day. Forgotten how beautiful this is? How can you forget? The music in this game, the scenery is just incredible. Tell me about Vesemir. Things any better between you? It seems so. Old man's dropped the moralizing, and I try not to piss him off too often. Mm -hmm. Working out well? Moderately. Castle's pretty big. Easy to stay out of each other's way. Damn it! I moored it right here, I swear! Line must have come loose. Really? Here I thought the boat untied itself to go for a jaunt on its own. Damn it. In this fog, we'll never... There a storm before I arrived? Let me think. Yeah, five days passed. Hmm. Wind must have grabbed the sail, tugged the boat off its mooring. Boat drifted into the bushes. Buckthorn. Thanks. That building doesn't look like it is according to code. Probably not. Is he just standing back? Go fight them. Water hag. Great. Last thing we needed. Love a good water hag. entrance is just opposite see it gotta sail across the pond go through the cave climb trolls head and we're there doesn't seem like such an ordeal now does it no still gives me the shivers though you know only two boys returned from my group you were the ones who ran into old spear tip in the caverns right mm-hmm let's go jump in the boat all right I'm taking the tiller though because? Because it's my boat, not up for discussion. I want to look at these guys. Oh yeah, that's fine. Just checking.
stone off them now. All that good loot I just picked up. I need more buckthorn. Which is in the water, but I've not this seen any. Yourself? Yeah. Something you don't like about it? Besides the water up to our ankles? Nothing. Quit whining. It'll make it across the lake. Provided we don't smash into something first. I barely see the tip of my nose. You're a witcher, you've got witcher senses. Why do you need to be able to see? Fog's thick as curdled milk. Never took you for a poet. Oh, but I am one. Want to hear a limerick? Sure. Lambert, Lambert, what a prick. Not bad. This is a great conversation. Fall off a bit. Sails fluttering. Don't teach your grandma to suck eggs. Right, almost there. Ready for the caverns? Almost. Before we go inside. Ugh, drink a dose of cat, I know. Any more words of wisdom? Like, step softly or you'll wake old spear tip? Old spear tip still down there? Yeah, he is. Unless he's done us a favor and killed over on his own. Could come at us at any moment. How'd the rhyme go? Old spear tip's a deep sleeper. Wake him up and you'll sleep deeper. Come on. Sounds fun. <laughs> Hear that? Sounds like a kid. You know this valley's uninhabited except for us. Gotta be an illusion. What if it's not? <laughs> Whatever you want to do. You're probably right. Let's go straight to the cave. I'm Finally, sure I went and did it the last time. Reasonable. So I'm just going to ignore it this time. Hold on. Can I meditate here? Kid has a Not voice like that, exactly. Ghost. Remember? It's a trap. Part of the trials. A witcher is a lone hunter. But even a lone hunter can use a helping hand sometimes. Vesemir. Ready? Oh, you fat fuck. Oh yeah, he's totally fat. One, two, It's just three. hiding under all his bulging muscles, you know? You're no feather either. Come on. Let's go. Hmm. Wall looks a little shaky. Ard, maybe? Mm -hmm. And wake old spear tip? What? You afraid? No, I just My think God, before I act. Like that. Relax, I slipped. fell in my eye. Splinter, I think. Hope it wasn't from a broken mirror. That'd make you even nastier. Ha ha. Ugh. 
place reeks of mold. What did you expect? Scent of violets? Would it be? Ah, uh, so soft and sweet to sleep in there. Makes you want to make this moment last forever. Good to be back above ground. Mm-hmm. Still trouble ahead. You mean the trolls? They're in for trouble, not us. Don't know who you're trying to impress. Tough guy stuff's just not working on me. <laughs> Look who's talking. Vesemir told me about that job you did for those Nilf guardians in Velen. What? What are you doing? Killing monsters. <laughs> Good one. Just came out that way. <laughs> Come on. Place of power. Should draw from it. Also, let's remove the cat eye. See him shit and run soon as he saw us? Mm -hmm. Never known a troll to do that. It's a trap. Always getting pelted with bolts, I know. I keep thinking I've got my torch equipped. Which us is to walk no more. It stops. This mountain, Trolley Mountain. Troll Mountain. Huh? Oh. Uh, hi! This Troll Mountain. Ah, uh, you talk to these idiots. Stay calm. We just want to get to the circle. Which is this thing one say, thing two do? Thing three do sometime. Ah, uh, enough! Out of my way, dimwits, or I'll grind you to gravel. Understand? Oh, this guy. Ha ha ha. They understood all right. Congrats. Run for the cave before they stone us to death. Need my supplies, you know. I'm a witcher. I can do these things. We walk those. Those goes no far more. Witches is understanded. We understand it, but we still gotta get to the circle of elements. Listen, but we. But we. The witches a castle. Rock Slotler. Let a rock. Enjoying this little chat? Cause, uh, it's not getting us anywhere. I'm talking. Fact is, you know as much about negotiating as they do about grammar. We're not here to hurt you. We don't want to touch your rocks. Just let us pass. Throw rock, throw. Witches he strike no back. Just talky talky. Witcher, good? Over you. Which is his monster kills trolls monsters. Yes, true is. No face make. Mm. Um. 
We took all this. You shall back up leave here. Use pass. No queens. We smash. Oh, sharp back clubs or swords? All right, we'll leave our swords here. Pick them up on the way back. We want to know. Ugh, metal. Mouth thing. You nuts? Shut up and follow my lead. I think you might have missed your calling. Mm -hmm. If I remember Pappy Vesemir's lessons correctly, witchers kill monsters. Shut up. Well, we made it. No denying that. Damn. Beautiful view. We can soak it in later. Of course, duty before pleasure. Remember how this circle works? Been a while since I activated my medallion here. It's fine, old man. No need to make excuses. Light the torches and place the phylactery on the altar. I'll handle the rest. How'd it go? Water, then earth, then air? <gasps> How did I not die? <sighs> Can't believe I didn't die, Jesus Christ. Phylactery's in place. Then all we gotta do is wait. So you're saying he the just roofed the off the, the mountain? While we catch a breather. <laughs> Seems legit. So, how'd you deal with the trolls when you passed the trial of the medallion? Let me think. Oh uh, yeah, used Axie. But I only had to get past one troll. Other two were busy. Yeah, useful sign, Axie. Saved my life a short while ago. Yeah, Axie's useful. And dangerous. <laughs> what makes you say that? It tempts you to overuse it. Force a merchant to reduce his price. Make an arrogant noble drink from the gutter. Teach someone to show you respect. Can become hard to resist. I don't. Life's too <laughs> short. Tell me, you always been such a cynical bastard? No. I was adorable before Vesemir brought me to care more him. We all went through it. That's just it. Not everyone made it. Lots of boys died here. Boys taken against their will. It was our destiny. Destiny? Let me tell you about destiny. My dad was a drunk. He'd knock a few back, then beat me and mom bloody. We prayed for his death every night. One day our prayers were almost answered. Dad lost his way coming home from the tavern, walked smack into a nest of Neckers. But some witcher saved him. Know what he wanted in return? Give me the first thing you see when you get home. My life. For the life of that prick? I say fuck that kind of destiny. Know what? Let's get out of here. Don't like what you're hearing, huh? Witchers shouldn't talk like that. Know what else you won't like? After the trial of the medallion, I rode straight home to thank my daddy for everything. Want to hear what I did to him? Lambert, please. Thought we were opening up, having an honest talk. But fine, let's continue pretending everything's just peachy. This guy is such a whiny pain like in the ass. Our companions await.
Need to get our swords. Witcher with no swords like a man without an arm. Sure thing, brother. Which is his sharp back club takes and home goes. Mm-hmm. Don't worry. I don't need convincing. Come on, Geralt, let's go. Right, let's get back. After you, sir. Okay. Red boy. Hmm. Must be Eskel's prince. No one else has left the keep recently. Is this still not working? This is becoming a bit of an issue. I need all the plants. Oh, there's book. Oh no, it's hornwort. It's different. Oh, is that it there? turned into favours. It was definitely one I needed it for. Oh yeah, I just need two more. What's that? One more, and then I um, can make that potion. Always take the war. That's his oh, horse. Fuck my What's its name. Scorpion. Beautiful animal. Oh, that fucking horse. Shit, man, that just came out of nowhere. I was crap myself. <laughs> <laughs> I 
I was listening to the noise, like around in the that you get from the Witcher sound. Esco made camp here. Looks like he planned to stay outside a while. Oh, enhanced draconid oil, nice. Oh. Footprints and hoofprints. A goat. Interesting. Okay, unrelated to the jump scare, I actually need to pee. <laughs> it may have just made it more noticeable. I'll be right back. <laughs> 